Okay, we're going to do the name Emily in Descript now. Now, these letters are all pretty standard. The combinations are all pretty simple. There's no advanced combos or nothing that's hard to do work with here. Um, one of the, the lesser used combos would be putting the M inside of the E like so. But it's very hard to make that small and make it look good. So I tend not to use that version. Also, it can become ambiguous with other stuff and it's just a personal preference. But that's always on the table should you like it. Now, the E M can be drawn by adding the M like so and then drawing the E line or by coming through like that. Obviously, in this case, we'll try to first draw the simplest straight version. E, M, I, L, Y. Now, the interesting combinations available to us in this word would be, first of all, the I, L. So, I plus L can actually be like that. See here? There's your L. And then you just connect the word off the bottom. So that, sorry, so this is I-L-Y. Now, the hard part about this is you've got to get this and the preceding portion of the letter into the I cup, so they can conflict. You can try to squeeze them onto each side of each other, like so, so, M, Millie, like separating them that way, but I try to just draw the I slightly more vertical, so that the M would come into the cup, and then you'll have your eye. That's my personal preference. But it tends to make them very tall, so you have to work with what you got. Now, you can also start up here, come around, and as you can see, there's a whole bunch of options. And especially when you use this version of the L, there's all the possibilities of where you're going to put your Y and where, which way you're going to angle the tail. So, as you can see, Emily is a very flexible word and does not have many advanced limitations or require many advanced strokes.